Nestled away in a mountain range, off the beaten track over on Microtech are the outposts of Moorland Hills and Razor's Edge. A combination of clifftop overlook and flatland farm, it's an interesting and unique destination to visit in the verse. I'm Farrister, and enjoying some of the places to go out and explore in Star Citizen is one of the main reasons that this location spotlight series exists. So, you're invited to sit back and enjoy as we head off the beaten track and visit these outposts on Microtech. For those intrepid explorers looking to find this place, head to the Harpers Point Quantum Jump Marker and then turn to a heading of 335 degrees for 55 kilometers. The outposts are fairly obvious during day and night, owing to the red light at the top of the towers of each. They're only a couple of kilometers from each other, so finding one place inevitably leads to finding the other. Up top on Razor's Edge, there's a tall tower surrounded by some outbuildings and decorative structures and props. The view all around is pretty cool to see, and is reason enough to venture up. The Crow's Nest is a particular highlight, showcasing the mountains all around and celebrating Microtech at its best. Down in the valley at Moorland Hills, there are some farm type structures. It's often possible to find some gemstones and some loot crates filled with goodies. All of the NPCs at both locations are fairly friendly towards law abiding citizens. For those who enjoy the scenic beauty of Microtech, these locations are well worth getting out for a visit. If you'd like to see more such sites, past and present, you might be interested to explore the other Location Spotlight videos on this channel. And if you're not yet subscribed here, you might like to consider that to have YouTube show you more videos like this in future. If you'd like to see more videos like this made for the channel, please do press that like button as it's helpful for me to know what videos to focus on. In any event, I'll be sure to read your thoughts in the comments below, but otherwise and as always, thank you for watching.